Hey, this is Master Adrian with W on Taekwondo and this is our first training video of our Kick Like a Pro series. The first thing we're gonna start with, it's uh, something very basic, it's chambering, uh, the way you bring your knee up and you should do that on any type of kick. doesn't matter that you are doing a front kick, a roundhouse, a back kick. When you start uh, learning how to kick, the first thing you should, you should know about is chambering the knee, all right? So bringing the knee up. That's why with beginners, you normally exercise and have them practice bringing the knee up, a simple move or bringing the knee up before they do any kick. They might start doing push kicks, they might start doing front kicks, they might start doing roundhouse in time or they can also do hook kicks when they're more advanced. So as you can see, probably can get my point so far, it's about bringing the knee up. No matter of new school or old school, bringing the knee up and chambering the knee up, it's as important as ever. For example, if I take a guarding stance and I'll try to do cut kick or multiple cut kicks, I'll have to bring my knee up and I can travel from there. Or I can just do one in the shuffle, or I can do one on the counter, or I can do one with a drop and counter, right? So no matter what you do, that knee goes up. For example, let's say let's do a hook kick, right? Knee up and you hook it. So if you fit all of this into a workout or with starting guarding stance, make sure you have good space in between your feet, make sure you bend your knees, your arms are up. And we're gonna start with the knee up, and you put it down, and you bring the knee up and you put it down, and you're gonna keep doing this for about 20 reps total, which is 10 and 10. We're gonna have the next move, so that means we're resetting guarding stance. We're gonna start doing the kick this time. This is the most basic kick, which is a push kick. Bring the knee up, push, and bring the knee up and push. All right, as you can see, you can do this on the spot. You don't need a lot of space for learning this part of the training. And let's move further. After you did a push kick, 20 total, 10 each side, three sets, where I'm gonna reset the guarding stance and let's do the last kick, which is the front kick. Make sure you point your toes when you release this one. So we're gonna chamber again, knee up, release, knee up, release, all right? Then here we have 20 total, 10 and 10, and I think that's a good workout. All these uh, three sets each would mean nine total sets, it should take you maybe at the most 10 minutes to 15 minutes a day uh, and after you feel like you master these moves, these little moves, chambering and releasing the most basic kicks, you're gonna be able to move further to lesson number two. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. W1 out.